Hello, YouTube. I have a confession to make. It's that time of the month, which can only mean one thing. It's time to read from the Quran. So the sacred months have passed away. Then slay the idolaters wherever you find them, and take them captives and besiege them, and lie in wait for them in every ambush. Then, if they repent and keep up prayer and pay the poor rate, leave their way free to them. Yes. I just read from the Quran when I'm unclean. <laughs> That's a horrible blasphemy. I have a few other things that I can do also. What is the Absolutely not shaking your What is the Absolutely not So yeah, if you think me reading from the Quran or wearing a rosary, making pictures, do you think all that stuff, especially the fact that I'm wearing a bra only, <laughs> quite lovely, I think, don't you? Do you think all that is blasphemy? And is something that people should, like, kill me over or whatever? Let's look at this. Some of the images you're about to see will be very, very disturbing. I've seen them. I can testify to that. Let's go to CNN's Brian Todd. He's watching all of this grim material for us. Brian? It is indeed grim, Wolf, and we have new details on the investigation into this killing, which an official in that Iraqi province told me has shocked everyone there. You're about to witness an honor killing. A 17-year-old girl dragged into a crowd in a headlock. Uniformed men, apparently security forces, look on and do nothing. Plenty of other men around to stop it. Instead, many capture it on cell phone video. Partially clothed, Dua Khalil is kicked and stoned to death. A top official in northern Iraq's Nineveh province, where this occurred last month, tells CNN Dua had been seen with a Sunni Muslim man. She had not married him or converted, this official said, but her attackers believed she had. So why do I make this video? I make this video to show you that I'm free. That's why I'm wearing a bra, which apparently Muhammad hates it when tits are exposed because you're supposed to be modest and covered up. Because apparently guys can't control their sexual behavior. Shame on your guys! <laughs> Whatever. Look at me. I'm in a bra. Woo! <laughs> I do this because I'm free. Because I don't believe in their bullshit. I'm an atheist. I'm wearing a rosary around my neck like jewelry. I'm an atheist, so obviously, this is sinful and not right or whatever. I am free. I am me. I'm not putting on anything to make me look like not me. This is it. I'm not afraid. Fear is their biggest weapon. That's how they control you. Well, guess what? You don't control me. You never have, and you never will. So you know what? Fuck Jesus and Muhammad. They are not worthy of my prayer. You know who is, though? Dionysus. The beautiful wine god. And he's very, very yummy. Also, <laughs> the blood of children. <laughs> Not really. My wine. <laughs> no blood involved. That's your god. I'm an atheist. <laughs> Thank you, better call.